All right, welcome everybody. Uh, thank you for coming here tonight. I'm Dr. Stephen Franson. Uh, tonight we're going to be talking about the immune system. This is Boost Your Immune System in 21 Days, Part 2. All right. Uh, the first Boost Your Immune System, how many people came to the first course and have seen the video? Is everybody watching the DVDs that we're putting out there? You guys appreciating those and loving those? Uh, we'd love to have them available for you. It just it's, it excites us because you can get engaged and wanted to learn more. Um, so, that's a reminder. Everybody shut off your cell phones, please. <laughs> Our concert of EPP, that we up. Uh, so tonight's workshop is a follow-up to part one. And part one discussed the immune system itself as an entity. I wanted you to understand how uh, the, what organs were involved, what was the anatomy, what was the physiology, how did they sense it? What an interesting way to start looking at TV, right? So you've got to start asking the question, are you trying to get comfortable or are you trying to get healthy? Getting sick is an interesting expression. You all talk about, oh yeah, I'm getting sick. And what are some of the symptoms that people are usually talking about and describing when they, when they describe themselves as getting sick? Just shut them up. Okay. You don't feel good, runny nose, sneezing, coughing, mucus, right? Vomiting, diarrhea, fever, headaches, fatigue, right? Those are all things that we call getting sick. It's really interesting because when you start looking at the immune system, how the immune system functions, all of the things that we term getting sick are actually what? Getting healthy, getting better. All of these things that we describe as getting sick and the symptoms or the syndromes associated with fighting an infection and your body doing absolutely everything that it's innately, genetically programmed to do to bring your body back towards homeostasis and get you back to health. All of those manifestations are all perfect expressions of your immune system. So we're going to operate under three basic premises. The first is that you have an innate drive toward health. I taught you that word in module one. What's the word for that? Use an H. Homeostasis, right? Our cells are programmed to drive us back to health. Remember the example I used? If you smoke for 30 years and you quit smoking, that day what does your body start doing? Moving back towards health. Your body is programmed to drive towards 